Alright, welcome back. This is going to be part 98 of my presentation on dinosaurs and man. And this presentation, this will be the last uh, video about uh, showing, at least, the di a dinosaur and a human track together. And so, um, or showing um, a human track in the area where the dinosaur tracks were found at the Paluxy River. Um, I've got about three, maybe four videos after this. And we're just going to look at human prints in general that were found in several areas on our planet. And, um, and, and what we're, what we're going to do is we're going to compare them to, uh, some of the tracks that were found. And, uh, cause some of the arguments that, uh, people have made is that, um, they, they don't see it or it don't look human or they can't tell that it looks like a human track. Well, we're going to, what we're going to do is we're going to look at other tracks that have been found and that they said, yes, those are human tracks. We, we, those are legit tracks. And we're going to compare them to the tracks that that's at the Paluxy River. It's quite amazing, guys, and quite revealing when you look at it in that light. Uh, but this track here, now this one that I'm going to be talking about is, has been called the Dino Slash Girl Track. And now I do have a cast of this track. Um, I'm not going to show it because I haven't stained it yet, um, like I did the Japanese track. And so, now I've had this track for a long time, many, many, many years I've had this track. And so, it's really uh, procrastination on my part, And um, but it's a large track. It's a real large track, And uh, but I do have it. I do have it sitting by, behind me, um, tucked away in this little area. Uh, but at any rate, we're going to talk about this. If you guys will notice on the screen here, um, this track is featured in this book here, Fossil Facts and Fantasies. And we're going to talk about some things that Joe said um, about this track and because he had some involvement with it. And uh, now, again, when we're talking about the Paluxy River tracks, the, um, they're found in Cretaceous limestone, and which should not, they, it shouldn't be there. It's the, the human tracks along with dinosaur tracks should not be there, or there should be no human tracks. Even if there were no dinosaur tracks around there, just finding human tracks in this area is very damaging to the evolutionary um, timeline. And so, because humans, by their theory, um, didn't ev evolve into or start evolving until 1.8 to 6 million years ago. So somewhere between 6 million years to 1.8 million years, they didn't even start evolving. Now, you might, some people might say, Dadgum, Donnie, that's a, long, that's a large amount of time between those two dates. You're right, because it didn't happen. <laughs> and so that's the theories, guys, and I'm serious. That's the, de the range of time that I've been able to find. And so where humans supposedly started evolving. Now, this track here, uh, this is a picture. Picture to the left is um, uh, is the trackway um, that was uh, that was uh, researched, and uh, again, it was made by an Acrocanthosaurus um, dinosaur, which looks a lot like a T. Rex. Now, the Acrocanthosaurus tracks are very prevalent in this area. Uh, you're going to see a lot of them. Now, this is that one track. If you'll notice the one that circled there in red. Um, now, the one to the right, what I did is I just kind of blocked it off and colored it in. And so that's the general shape of it there. There's the general outline shape there, and there's the claws. So you guys can see that a little bit better. Now, the human footprint is dead center in it. Now, the toes would be up top, and then you got the arch, and then you got the heel. And so... Um, that is, and you can see, just looking at it, you can see the general shape of the foot there. Now, reportedly, there was a trail of these small tracks across the area. Now, what they did is they allowed a 15-year-old girl, um, five foot, five inches tall, to place her left foot in there, and it was a perfect fit. Um, it says, uh, Joe says, this dinosaur track is from a trackway which had been excavated in about 1983 and was thought to be just another um, of the many three-toed carnivore tracks in the river. But in 1998, the trackway was swept clean and it was discovered that all of the clay 
had never been cleaned out of the limestone when done a well, but when they did it, a shape exactly rem- resembling a small human foot with heel arch and five toes was revealing cutting across the center of the animal's track. Uh, of course, it caused a stir, and uh, Joe Taylor, who had left the site an hour and a half before, was called by car phone to return immediately. Um, Joe returned and immediately molded the track, and a cast was made from the mold before nightfall. Dr. Dave McQueen's 16-year-old daughter, Miriam, put her foot in the cast. It appeared to be a very good fit. Okay, Joe last uh, finally says here, no one here in Texas has ever seen a dinosaur before, yet everybody knows a dinosaur track when they see it. The same experts, though, can't recognize a human footprint even though they have seen lots of them. Science has a lots of experts. And so, and I will agree to that. And so, uh, but guys, uh, we're going to stop right there. Um, uh, this is going to be it for the showing dinosaur and human footprints together. Um, as far as showing you examples, now we're going to start getting into human tracks that have been found um, all over the planet uh, in different areas. I'm just going to um, pick and choose just a few a few areas to talk about. And so we're looking at maybe three or four more videos. Um, and then we'll, we'll be done with this topic here. From there, I'll be showing um, testimonies um, of people that have had their hands or have eyewitnessed um, the dinosaur and human tracks uh, uh, at the Paluxy River. And then I'm going to be sharing also um, Ian Juby's um, outstanding presentation that he did on the dinosaur and human tracks at the Paluxy River. And so I think he did about six videos. And so very good. And so those will be shared from YouTube also. Um, and so, but I will we'll be doing that once um, I finish up this whole complete block all, all, to, all together. So we're showing maybe about three or four videos. And, uh, but you guys take care. I love you. And I hope the Lord blesses you real good. Bye-bye.